you could do your differentiations. So, for example, let's just say we take this athlete up, we're looking for any symptoms that they have, any sort of replication, any tightness, any tautness, or you might feel that there is a definite neural block to that movement. So you'll take them up as a differential, whether it's hamstring tension or whether or not it is neural, what we'll do is look at adding adduction or abduction. So to take off some neural tension from a sciatic perspective, what we're looking at is adding abduction and lateral rotation potentially adding some plantar flexion, or you can go the other way where you've got medial rotation, adduction, or potentially some uh, dorsiflexion at the ankle. You could add some cervical flexion or extension, depending on whether you will want to add bias to that neural tissue proximally from there.